Riker. Yay. Thank you so much for being here. My pleasure. It's a pleasure to have you. Thank you. So can we talk about your fitness diet a little bit? Can we t tell me everything? Well, my fitness diet, I'm, I'm teaching and I'm coaching. And the difference between your fitness diet, do you have a difference between your fitness diet when you're training and your diet like generally too? Well, I can talk about the time when I was active, when okay. I was competing. I definitely had meat in my food. Oh, yeah. I felt, I always said, until I retire, then I'll become a vegetarian. Yeah. Because the meat, the protein, and the aggression of the animal, I needed to compete. That's so interesting. You yeah. actually felt the, like you needed that aggression. That's interesting. If you eat meat, do you think in general people are more aggressive? Yeah, I am. Yeah, so interesting. I, I remember I did Fit for Life uh, many years ago. Okay. When I did, I wanted to retire. I didn't want to fight back. I didn't want to hit back. So it definitely made me more passive, more friendly, more forgiving, more loving. Yeah. So things. I put the meat right back in my food so I could keep knocking them out. Interesting. Um, but definitely I had uh, protein with uh, almost every meal and I had six meals a day. Every meal had some sort of are you um, talking about like a, a meat dairy, protein yeah. or are you, okay. a dairy protein? In a it. dairy protein. Yeah. Okay. And, and that I, was working for you? As a fighter in yeah. your fitness. Okay. It works for me uh, muscle mass wide, uh, wise. I was lean. I had very little fat percentage. Yeah. And performance wise, it worked for me too. And also because I fought in weight classes, it was easier to monitor my weight uh, with the protein and the vegetable combination. Or, or if I do food combining, it was easier for me to control my weight and to direct my weight and to predict my weight. Uh, going into the raw food and the vegetarian, it was a whole new journey to get familiar with how my body responded to what types of foods. And how did it respond differently? Well, when I'm all raw, I'm wiry and light. I sleep four or five hours. That's and kind of interesting. Um, yeah. I'm friendly, energetic, but not grounded. Yeah. So I add uh, the more fat to uh, my diet, the avocados and the uh, natural plant fats. Yeah. Yeah. However, fat is fat, so I have to really be careful not to add too much fat from the avocados and the yeah. nuts to my diet. You need just the right amount. Yeah, to ground me. So I'm still in the process of figuring out what works for me that actually is also healthy for me as well, because fat now, is fat. How do, you, how do you approach eating meat when you eat meat in terms of how do you buy it? How do you... Well, right now I don't eat meat in this moment, but when I eat meat, I definitely, it's a requirement that it's free range yes. and hormone free. Yes. Um, I limit my meat intake if I ever eat it twice a week, okay. four ounces. Um, I like to cook because I like to know where my meat comes from. And if I eat out, mm -hmm. I ask, where's the meat from? What's in it? And these where's days, the meat from? What's in it? Right. Yeah. I, I want to make sure that the animal that I eat had a healthy life. Mm -hmm. I mean, we, you know, sometimes my body needs protein, like when I'm a little more Intense in my training, my body craves chicken. Like I went to Air One the other mm -hmm. day, and or a couple months ago, and I was in a competition of some sort of race okay. about being uh, having lean muscle mass. Yeah. And then I looked at that chicken, and I was like, Oh my God, I'm gonna have it! After three <laughs> years vegetarian, strict vegetarian. I'm gonna have it. And let me tell you, I ate that chicken to the bone, and I yeah. don't <laughs> eat the bone. I don't eat. The, I was like. You know, sucking the bone because it was, I wanted it. Yeah, no, I and, totally understand. I've had similar experiences when I'm backpacking where I've seen a wild turkey and I've been like, I need to kill it. I need to eat it. Like, yeah. there, I've had that experience. I know what you mean.